so welcome to another Share Community video. I'm Radia, and today I'm joined to with the Waste team from Tokyo University Field Course. Um, so yeah, guys, can you introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Kirara, and I'm a third year in Environmental Sciences. I'm Ikumi, and I'm my major is Pharmaceutical Sciences. Hi, I'm Yosuke and I'm majoring in Applied Physics in the Faculty of Engineering. Hi, I'm Zichin and I major in Medicine. Hello, I'm Hiroki and I major in Biomass Sciences. Okay, first question. So what is you guys' uh, project as Waste Team? So we are under the topic of sustainability. We are researching about the waste project in Bali, and we want uh, and we did some interviews with each stakeholders, like government, residents, and some NGOs. And we are trying to find out the problems of the waste management system in Bali and find out uh, what can be solved. Okay, and then. When you were still in Japan, how was your preparation for coming here? Um, so first, so we during class we learned about how to conduct our field work and what to do with our interviews and how to analyze and those kind of things. And also we um, did research on the current waste management system in Bali and we let, read some literature before coming. Before coming here, any expectation you expect from doing a field course in Bali, Indonesia? Um, honestly speaking, because the field work was very intense, I kind of forgot what I expected because <laughs> it was so extense this field work. But I think I was expecting like a very uh, strict um, uh, interviews with the like the governments and stuff, and yeah, and also some very nice summer Bali <laughs> vacation. <laughs> yes. Okay, and from those expectations, is it actually according to that expectation or anything you discovered that is beyond your expectation? Uh, first, uh, I was surprised that the government system in Indonesia is really uh, uh, complex. and then, uh, But we thought that uh, the system is still developing, but uh, we found that uh, some villages have really uh, developed system and they make uh, some great system and then we thought that this is a very good uh, solution to all parts of Bali. So, yeah. And lastly, uh, for the students doing this course next year, do you guys have any advice or any tips, any message you want them to know? Okay, thank you. Um, so Bali, it's a wonderful place. It's a little hot, but it's beautiful. The food's good. And the people were very eager to answer our interview. So I expect the students next year to enjoy their time here, enjoy where they are and what they get to study. And um, tips is that um, sometimes interviews, they get canceled suddenly. So <laughs> don't panic and use that time to prepare for further questions because the people here at Shuriko, they, they supported us and helped us get other interviews and that helped a lot with our research so I'm very thankful for that so um, prepare and enjoy <laughs> uh, anything anybody else want to add like anything you're not supposed to do you're not supposed to do you're not supposed to do in Bali um, so we were told that we're not supposed to ride motorcycles because it's very dangerous and um, for the for research um, so we, um, I think it's important to um, be logical about what, how you're progressing your um, research. And for from interviews, like we always get something that we don't know and like we didn't expect. So um, it is important to be able to um, kind of be flexible about those information you get. Okay, thank you so much, guys, and to the viewers. Bye. Thank you for watching this video. If you want to give a suggestion on sustainability issues or guests we should interview, please do so on the comment section below or through our social media. If you like this kind of content, please like this video, subscribe to our channel, 
and click the notification icon so you can get notification when we post new videos. We also sell coffee and chocolate to support sustainability issue and you can buy them on the Tokopedia link below. Thank you.